Hi everyone, this is Dr. Lahari from Leo Dental, Bangalore. When you want to smile, when you want to show that you are happy, and when you can't do that, it's the most uh, unhappy feeling in the world. There are things that stop you from smiling are bad teeth, are stains on your teeth, marks on your teeth. There are many people who socially distance themselves who hesitate to smile and very very happy with the masks these days because they are preventing from showing them smile. So when you are a person with marks on your teeth, stains on your teeth or dots or discrepancies on your teeth, it makes it very difficult for you to smile. Why are there stains on your teeth? Why are there marks on your teeth? Stains, marks and dots on the teeth can be two types. One are intrinsic or inner strains, one are extrinsic or outer strains. Outer stains are due to food, habits like tobacco and all. Inner stains are developed during the tooth formation. Extrinsic or outer stains can be removed through simple procedures like cleaning, root planing, sometimes bleaching. But intrinsic or inner stains on the teeth which are developed during the tooth formation are very difficult or almost impossible to remain. One such condition that causes brownish, yellowish or even reddish teeth is fluorosis. Fluorosis occurs on your teeth when you drink fluoride rich water during your early age that is from 5 to 8 years of age you are drinking water with high amount of fluoride you tend to get fluorosis spots on your teeth. This fluorosis can range anywhere from mild, moderate to severe to very severe form. Mild forms will have whitish spots on your teeth, moderate forms will have brownish teeth, severe forms will have chipping or breaking of the teeth making the teeth look very very ugly. They look very brown and they chip off and they go out of the shape also. This is a very serious problem in certain parts of India like Rajasthan, Nalgonda and Prakasham district of Andhra. People from here, everybody show fluoride marks on their teeth. But here in Karnataka also, in some parts of India also, fluoride teeth are occasionally seen. Earlier there were no treatment for fluorosis. But with the advent of many cosmetic procedures, now fluorosis can be very, very easily tackled. But the treatment is not a benchmark, it's custom made according to your problem. From a simple composite laminate to a veneer to a complete coverage crown, uh, there is a wide range of smile designing treatments that are available that can make a fluorosis patient go from a very severe, badly malpositioned teeth to a very beautiful smile. So when you have brown stain, white stain, yellow or red stain on your teeth, just see the dentist, diagnose what caused your stain, talk to him, have a discussion, know what treatment modality is best suited for you. Don't think like my friend has done that, my colleague has done this. Everything doesn't suit every individual. Go to a dentist, properly discuss your problem. Know the treatment modality is available if it can be handled in a small pattern or it has needs a extensive therapy. Go for it, take a treatment and fix your brown spots, white spots, have a beautiful smile. It can be caused due to an accident, caused due to some medicine that are taken during the pregnant times or due to fluoride water intake. Knowing the etiology or cause of the stain will help the doctor to tackle it in the most effective way. To summarize, every stain can be tackled, every stain can be treated and everybody deserves a beautiful smile. Go for a counselling, go for smile designing and have the prettiest smile possible.